since I don't have a blue wheel, this is my painstaking process of separating my black sands, magnetic sands, from my fine gold. And right now, I have this pan here. This is my main pan I'm starting from. What I'll do, I'll come in, I'll pick up some material out of here on the magnetics. I'll bring it to this one and I'll smack it in the water a couple times. It's releasing gold right there already. It's stuck in the black sand. So now I'll drop that right here. So we come back over here, poke through that a little bit. And I'll dump it up there in this other pan. Oh yeah, I gotta clean this one out. So this one was already cleaned earlier. I'm gonna double check, make sure there was nothing left in this pan. Just do it like that. Saving my black sands over here in this one. All my magnetics, because there's something in there. Every now and then it sure looks like one in there. number of things. Everything from metal from my pry bars. Okay. That one's cleared out ready for a, another load here. From this one. Okay. Pop this one around a bit. See little pieces in there. And back over here. Tap it on the back, pick up this stuff, shake it off. Oop, one fell out right there. Here's some that right in the middle. Put that right in the middle right there. Now, I'll tap this here a couple times. And back out here, drop it once. Put it all right there. Come on back again. Repeating this time and time and time again. Oh, there's more gold just fell out of it. Right there in the Right there. So, looks like that, ooh, still dropping some gold out of it, so maybe I'll just set that right there for a second, come back through all of this. Alright, all that section right here. Free of magnetics, so dump that back there. Now I have a snuffer bottle filled with water here. We know there's no magnetics here, so we're gonna let's make us a clean spot here. Now I have another spot to work here. Get this one full again. Gonna separate this piece of gold right now from the rest of these magnetics. And we're just gonna push all that to one side. Now I got another clean area to work. So, anyway, as you can see, this is not the easiest part of becoming rich in mining and prospecting. Lots of work, lots of patience, and uh, let's just take a peek in there. That's still left in there. That right there's got gold in it. All that back there's got gold in it. This does not, and this does not. This is my black sands. I'm going to save all that, dry it out, put it in a bucket. Sometime, eventually, a, a gold wheel will appear. That's the only way we can separate that out. 
lots of flower gold out here on the Trinity River. It's being turned over every day. Winter time is hitting right now. We just had our first uh, snowfall out here on top of the mountains at 7,000 foot around us. We're at 2,000. So, and we've got another dusting today. So, they're calling for 25 degrees tonight. We just went from 95 degrees the other day to this. So, summertime is gone. Fall is here and about to disappear. All right, guys, CGT prospecting. Have a great afternoon. After another hour or so, I'll get all this separated out. I'll dry it out, get it on the scale, and show you just what the yellow bar found when I tossed it in the air and where it landed. All right. Uh, there's that nice little sliver right there. All right, guys.